Stevenson with a 2-2 tie with Fredonia here on this Saturday at the Reisterstown Sportsplex with head coach Dominic Dawes. Let's take the overview first of the weekend. You get a win and a tie uh, out of these two games. Every day is a new learning experience for this program. Thoughts on getting a win and a tie out of these two games? I think it's good. I mean, I think tonight was a, a good step for us to show a little bit of resiliency and, and battle back. I thought the first two periods, you could see the wear and tear from last night and, and having to kill 25 minutes in penalties. I, I think we were hit. We were tired, and you could just kind of see that in the way we played. But to the guys' credit, I mean, they we lose another two bodies tonight, and short bench battle back, and I think that's a big a big step for this group. Let's go back to the second period for a minute. You lose your captain, and you have a five-minute penalty there. You finally give up a goal with 59 seconds remaining on that, but limiting that damage. How big was that to allow you to get that rally in the third to get a point here? I, I think that was huge. I mean, I, I think to kind of use that as almost a small victory in a sense, with knowing at that point. Guys were pretty tired, pretty worn down, and we, we had a pretty decent kill. And then we came out, and I, I think obviously getting the early power play goal in the third sure. was, a, was a big momentum lift or energy lift to just kind of see that, hey, it's one more shot and we can, we can do this. Um, we just battled and we stayed with it. Let's talk about the energy from Doug Rose on the second one. I mean, so many times during that shift, he seemingly did something to keep possession of the puck, and eventually he sends it toward the net. Christian puts it in, and you guys do get the tying goal. Yeah, I mean, hey, you need leadership to come in all ways, shapes, and forms. And uh, ultimately, by the end of that game, Doug was the only upper. I mean, Doug and Jake, the goalie, were the only upperclassmen on the ice. Um, and we lost Mike, to, the captain, and Jordan Watt. Had, we lost him halfway through the game right. to an injury. Um, I, I mean, he's just he's been there every night, every day for us. And you know, for him to kind of get rewarded and the guys get rewarded, I think it's big. All right, let's finally let's talk about your goal. I mean, Jacob in the third period, there's about a five-minute stretch there where he just made silly save after silly save, move inside to side in the crease, uh, coming up with big saves for you. Uh, thoughts on his performance here tonight? Did his job. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I mean, he was he was fantastic. I mean, uh, we he puts us in a position to to battle back, and honestly, that's what you, what's what you want in a goalie every, every night. You want him to give you a chance to chance to win or a chance to compete, and and that's what he did, especially the, a young group. You know, obviously there was no, we were still making mistakes through the third period, but I, I just thought we had a little bit more energy, and that's what helped us kind of fight our way through it. I right, appreciate the time. We'll see you on Tuesday night. Thank you. All right, head coach Dominic Dawes, 2-2 tie, Stevenson and Fredonia here at the Reisterstown Sportsplex.